Jelango, the current member of parliament representing Langata constituency, found himself embroiled in a controversy over alleged involvement in a fake gold scam syndicate. Reports circulating online suggest that the legislature, in collision with two influential politicians, conspired to defraud a Tunisian national of over 1 billion Kenyan shillings in a counterfeit gold transaction. The intricate scheme apparently unfolded as the trio possessed insider information on the origin and legitimacy of the fraudulent gold. The Tunisian victim's ordeal began upon his arrival in Kenya, where he spent an agonizing hour at the airport without assistance. Subsequently, he was lured by a taxi driver who promised to safety transport him to his intended destination. Instead, the victim was taken to Ngara, a district in Nairobi where he was held in Mikado for an entire week before being summoned to an undisclosed office in Garden Estate. The captors demanded an initial payment of 500 million Kenyan shillings before granting access to the alleged gold. After a preliminary examination and verification of a small sample, the victim was expected to pay the remaining 600 million Kenyan shillings. However, their plans were swiftly disrupted by law enforcement detectives. Among the numerous suspects apprehended during the operation was a police officer linked to the Kiminini DCI offices, suspected of being involved in shielding the criminal activities of these masterminds. However, in response to this widespread news coverage, Jelango has taken matters into his own hands, threatening legal actions against a newspaper for spreading news concerning the same. Jelango believes that the news are fabricated and he has never been involved in any scam. On his social media platforms, Jelango declared, Rogue media must be dealt with. After the steps I want to take against Citizen Weekly, I don't think they will ever sit down and write a defamatory story on anyone again. Then call to extort you in the name of cleaning your name. I'll not fall for that nonsense. Good day, Jelango said through his social media pages. That is it for now. Thanks for watching. Let's be next time. Bye bye.